Hey guys, Jonathan Brown Menzies, and it's time for another automotive product review. Here we have Foo's Twist Sunshades, and they're the invention of this guy here. Sorry for the glare. His name is Chip Foo's. I don't know if he's a race car driver or... Oh, it says actually these are his drawings. These are his sketches. Not bad. They work kind of like this. Even though they're small, they come in this tiny little package. They extend out. Two of them will cover your whole windshield. The reason I bought these, first of all, was the price. It was only $3.99 at a store called Ocean State Job Lot, which is in Massachusetts, but I've seen them in Connecticut, Rhode Island, kind of New England. And they're only $3.99, so $3.99 and my air conditioner is broken. Don't really have the money to fix it now. So hopefully this will kind of keep the car cool if you're, you know, shopping or whatever. Leave the car for an hour in the bright sunlight and you get back to a nice cool car when you use the Foos sunshade. So we're going to see how it works. Now they have these in two sizes. You can see the standard size and the jumbo size and they kind of give you a little guide here with the kind of car you have you just match it up $3.99 I figured what the hell it's a pretty good deal I bet if this was at AutoZone or if you got it online or whatever it would be a lot more it looks like it retails for doesn't say the retail price but I would guess I don't know $9.99 $14.99 because it's a name brand you know Chip Foos he's a name brand guy so let's see how this works because see how big they are there on that Cadillac that's a pretty cool Cadillac station wagon there and they come in the package really small Whoop, so sorry guys I'm trying to do this with one hand whoa and it just kinda oh and it's only one it's only oh no it's not it is two it is two they're just kinda stuck together so I guess they are bendable. You can, I don't know, you know what I'm going to do, guys? I'm going to see if I can use this for a storage container. See if I can just crunch it up again. Just let me turn the camera off and turn it back on because my camera's old school. So I was able to bunch it back up, kind of twist it up uh, pretty easily with no damage to the product. It's almost like a coat hanger, except it's thinner and it doesn't kind of stay shaped. So here we have, it looks like an old... Mustang maybe it's like a 60s or 70s car can't really tell and then we got a another race car there and a signature at the bottom so now for the real test I'm gonna bring these out to the old RAV4 put them in the window and see how it looks here we are guys a swelter and hot day in front of the RAV I got the Foos sunshades here and it's probably about a million degrees in the car so bear with me while I open the door and we'll try to put them in place got one in place and that's pretty convenient because they slide right behind the mirror just get it in there if you if you got two hands it's a, a lot easier this probably isn't the way you're supposed to do it this goes probably on the other side then you tie it to this one somehow but hey the main point is to get shade let's kind of tuck that in there yeah, that actually looks pretty good. Now I'm going to show you guys what it looks like from the outside. I can tell it's already about 10 degrees cooler in here. So I just lock the door. And there you have it, guys. The finished product, the Foos Sunshades for $3.99. It's absolutely a bargain get the full frontal shot. Everybody knows how it is if you're at a shopping center at the mall and you can't find that spot under the tree and you're sweating buckets when you get back to the car. So that's it guys, the Foo Sun Shades, if you can find them at a bargain, at one of those bargain shops, then I would highly recommend this product, $3.99, what a deal. If you like this channel, please hit the like button. Please hit the like button. Please leave me a suggestion. I respond to all comments. If you really like this video, please subscribe. Until next time, guys, Jonathan Brown Menzies, signing off.